As loggers attack the world's wild forests, scientists worry that the voracious demand for timber has led the world to consume trees faster than natural resources can grow them. More than 30 million acres are clear cut each year. That's an area the size of Mississippi every 12 months. In some areas of the world, we are deforesting, and that is certainly an area of concern. What happens to all this vanishing forest? Around 40% of all cut timber becomes lumber. Another 40% become chips for making paper. And the rest is shaped into furniture, pallets, and raw materials, fueling all kinds of industries. What is this more versatile? I mean, it's hard to beat. It's clear there will always be a demand for wood. And some tree scientists believe it's possible to create a never-ending supply. How? By developing a new breed of super tree. We want fast growth. We want to produce tons of biomass on a single acre. That's why a new generation of lumberjack is leaving the forest and heading to the farm. Because it's here that scientifically bred strands of super trees are redefining modern forestry. The future's in the tree farms like this. The plantations here are part of our forests of the future. It's really hard for me to believe that I'm, I'm logging in a desert. While maybe not quite the desert, this 30,000 acre farm in Eastern Oregon is a long way from the old growth forests. Greenwood Resources expects to harvest half a million trees here every year. And even with a tree falling every 16 seconds, this modern plantation should never run out of timber. We uh, currently have about uh, seven and a half million trees. That's about uh, twice the number of people in the state of Oregon. So we'll be able to harvest about five acres a day every day from here until eternity.